All right, everybody, we got a phone call in earlier today, so we're changing up the show tonight. And that is our advanced team at the ANA, which is in Chicago this week, came across a deal of San Francisco Morgans. They received the Morgans, they looked at the Morgans, and we can make this special offer available tonight. Won't last long, but it's time to dive into it. So we are talking about, again, the ANA, the large coin show of the year held in Chicago, going on this week, right? Wonderful place. Hope lots of you can attend. It's a wonderful experience, the largest in the country every year. The deal from our advanced teams, we have people going down the week before just to talk to people, see people, go over projects, etc. There was a San Francisco Morgan Dollar deal floating out there. Found out where it came from, got to the individuals involved, and then sat down and looked at the coins over the last day or so. There is a mixture of, on this particular graphic you're seeing on your screen, 80, 81, 82, they're in this deal. There's also 79s and 90s from what I've been told. So right now, we are very comfortable with up to five different being made available. Wonderful thing. All I was told is, if the coins you're looking at right now, that's just the average look. These rolls are outright superior, gorgeous, wow. So with that said, then time out, everybody. Look at the price now. Over the last six months plus, our prices on San Francisco vintage Morgans have been between 79 to 89 on the average coins. Some of the premium coins, even over $100, just the way the market has been working. This large deal we bought of Morgans had these S's inside of the deal. We can carve it out and now have this fun tonight. So let's take a step back and just talk about the Morgan dollars if we can for a second. So the craze over the last few years has been what? The modern issue Morgan and Peace dollars. That all came from 2021 and the 100th anniversary of the last Morgan dollar, the first Peace dollar. Over three sales in 2021, the U.S. Mint sold 175,000 of each Morgan, every one of them a quick sellout. We loved the program so much, they brought it back last year, 2023. They increased the mintage to 275,000 uncirculated coins. They made only one uncirculated coin, a Philadelphia coin, and that at 275,000 sold out instantly. This year, the 2024s were just recently released. Another beautiful coin. It's a Philadelphia strike this year. Again. Now, the unique thing with all of this said is the U.S. Mint for the brand new modern issue just raised their prices to $91 a coin. Raised them about 20%. Market conditions was what we were told. My guess is those of you that are a little bit connected or are on the internet probably found the same thing. So we can go back in time, almost 140 years, get the real Morgan dollars, not medallions or remakes or other countries' versions of the Morgan dollar. These are the real McCoys. And they're at $69.95 out of this deal. Now, it is a your choice. Up to five different is the number again. But they are $69.95 each. Your pick. Now, if you want 10... And right now, I, I know for sure there's five different. If there are a couple more than that, as they break this down further, we'll do our best. But if you're buying 10, which is a half roll, if we have five, you'll get two of each of the years we have available. So that way, it's not five different, which is wonderful, and your last five are all the same coin. As a collector, we wouldn't want that either. We won't do that to you. But the whole thing here is vintage San Francisco Morgans. Now... The Morgan dollar itself was the largest silver dollar ever put in the circulation here in the United States. It was issued during the time of our westward expansion. So it's called the westward dollar, right? Many people call them the cartwheels, which is like the wagon wheels, right? As the caravans moved from the plains out to the mountains and to the coast. During this journey, we find the largest silver find ever in America, which is known as the Comstock Load. After that, they petitioned the U.S. Mint, saying, hey, we got enough silver out west now to actually have a silver dollar. 
for our first 75, give or take, years as a government. After our independence, we didn't have a silver dollar for many, many of those years because we just didn't have enough silver to make silver dollars. Well, the Morgan dollar, the passage of the Bland-Allison Act, the Morgan dollar is named after George T. Morgan, the designer of the coin, and the rest is history. It is that coin of Jesse James and the Unger Gang. It's, it's the OK Corral, and they're in the gambling casino. What coins are they using? Well, the coin of the day was the Morgan dollar. It's just a great story of how our country expanded, how it grew, and this is the coin under it. Now, the Morgan dollar was made for 28 years, 1878 to 1904, and then again one more year in 1921. San Francisco, like Philadelphia, made one all 28 years. West Coast Mint, East Coast Mint. New Orleans came in for 26 years in the middle. Carson City even had a few coins, 13 of them. One for Denver at the very end back in 1921. Of all the mints, which of which there were five, the finest struck coins are San Francisco's. If you ask the experts, the authors of all the encyclopedias on the Morgan dollar and its history, the Loves, the Highfields, the Millers, who spent a half a century just chronicling the Morgan dollar and knowing as much about it as anybody, they all agreed on one simple premise. San Francisco all the way for quality. Look at the details. Outright gorgeous specimens. Now my competition have the same coins you're seeing on your screen. We're showing you three here tonight, 80, 81, and 82. I know there's 79s in the deal. I know there's 90s in the deal. It is so a minimum of five different, as I referenced. It's just a great deal. They range from 135 upwards of 175. That's our competition on the same exact coins. Guys, let's put that one minute clock up, please. Lots of activity. Thank you. If you're hearing the fast busy, and it's not a long one right now, only 15 or 20 seconds, remember, avccoins.com, great place to be, 24-7, 365. If you are looking for an exact coin, this is not the deal. If you want a 79S, we probably have them on the website, go grab it. But if you want to just have value, and you want to have, if you buy five, I know a 79S is going to be in there. It's just a random draw. So again, up to five different everybody at this crazy low price. $69.95. These are estimates, San Francisco premium quality coins. With the U.S. Mint just raising their price in the 2024s, of which there's going to be 275,000 of them, brand new. And it's a great coin. I have mine. I hope you do too. But they're at $91. You can go back 140 years into our history into the growth of this country, the early years of the Morgan dollar, and get them for only $69.95 here on ABC. So again, up to five different, they are all San Francisco's, all uncirculated, oh my. And that's why we call this segment, The Daily Deal.